Greetings, Earthlings. I'm Alan Boyle, Aerospace and Science Editor at GeekWire, and I'm here at the Pacific Science Center for a new exhibit called Expedition Titan that takes you on a virtual tour in virtual reality of one of the most interesting places in the solar system, Titan, a moon of Saturn. And I'm here with Baptiste Journeau, who is a research associate at the University of Washington, works with the NASA Astrobiology Institute, and he just happens to study icy worlds and places like Titan. And so who better to go through this exhibit with than Baptiste? So tell us a little bit about Titan and why it's so interesting. Yeah, so Titan is the second largest moon of the solar system, and it's the largest moon of Saturn. And uh, it is a fascinating place because it even though it's very far and very cold, it actually has a very thick atmosphere, like on Earth, and uh, and, it, and it has a lot of different um, geological activity that really reminds us of what's happening on Earth. It has like a, a hy like an equivalent of a hydrological cycle, but with methane instead of water. It has uh, volcanoes, uh, lakes, rivers, uh, deltas. So it's a very fascinating, fascinating place to study. And because we have so much uh, hydrocarbons also at the surface, we think that it's one of the best places in the solar system to actually study the possibility of extraterrestrial life right now. So uh, there is like a lot of work being done nowadays to try to go explore it more and to explore the possibility for life there. And so, for example, uh, uh, there was the, Cas the Higgins mission by NASA and the European Space Agency. And uh, the, the next mission is the NASA Dragonfly mission uh, that's going to arrive in the 2030s. Uh, and we'll also explore this in more detail. So we are very excited about that. So we survived our trip to Titan, had a great adventure. Uh, so what did you think? Well, uh, yeah, that was quite an adventure. Uh, that, was, that was very impressive, like the technology we have now to be able to explore these worlds that none of us probably will ever go in our lifetimes. It's just fascinating. And uh, so that's true that the scientist in me uh, was picking up like some tiny details uh, that were not exactly how it would be. But overall, it's a fantastic experience and I recommend to everybody to go see it. Mm -hmm. And definitely it's going to whet people's appetite to learn all about the science that goes into the virtual reality experience. And you can get all the details on GeekWire, on the NASA site, on the University of Washington, Pacific Science Center. It, it's a, a, a ride with a lot of adventure and enough science to keep you honest. So until next time, I'm Alan Boyle from GeekWire telling you to watch the skies, even the orange skies of Titan.